In this lesson, we will talk about HTML tables. Table provide an unique way to display the data in column and rows. So let's go ahead and open our editor. As always, I have already made the basic HTML structure. So now let's create a table with HTML. There are few tags that you need to remember when creating a table. The first tag that you need to remember is the table tag. So we start with the table tag. Now inside the table there can be three main elements T head, T body and T foot. As the name suggests, T head is used to contain the rows that holds the table header values. T body contains each and every row that must be included in the table except the headers. T foot is not necessary but we use it when we want to define some calculated value for the uh, T body. Like uh, when uh, you are creating an invoice with HTML table, in that case, you can use tfoot to show the total amount that the user have purchased. Okay, so let's start with the T head. Inside the T head, first we will add a single row that will contain one or more headers. TR is used to create table row and TH is used for table headers. Let's close the TR and T head as well. Now we will start adding content to our table body. In the same way, we will have some rows inside the body. But now, we will be using the TD tag. TD stands for table data. Once you have added all the necessary rows inside the T body, it's time to close the body and if in case your table needs a footer, you can add the footer as the T foot tag will be used to create the table footer and just like the other two, we will have some rows. Okay, so let's save it and see how the browser outputs our table. So here you can see the output of our table. So this is our table header. It is containing a single row with two headers, ID and name. And after the T head, here is our T body. And inside the T body, we are having two rows with different values. 
and finally the tea food that is containing a single row with two values for our columns so that is how you can use tables with html